Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. This is Greg with The Dapper Man. Today we will be talking about week 39 of my year-long beard journey, answering subscriber questions, and talking about what's next for The Dapper Man. So stay tuned. All right, welcome back. So as I stated earlier, I've completed week 39 of my year-long beard journey, so let's take a look and see how that's going. My mustache is continuing to give me problems. It is not behaving very well. Uh, here, right under the nostrils, you can see a little bit darker area. That's coming in really, really well, but around a little bit further out, not much. And it's to the point where it's becoming an issue when I eat. So what I have been using is this stash wax. I normally just put it on my beer, or sorry, on my mustache. We'll use it kind of like a chapstick. Kind of like that. And then I just comb it in. Comb it to the sides. It doesn't look fantastic. Uh, but it looks usually looks a lot better. And it just keeps the mustache out of my way when I'm eating. So I haven't decided what I'm going to do with my beard yet after my uh, 52 weeks are up. Uh, I'm definitely going to do some cleaning of the mustache, obviously. Get, clean up the lines along the cheeks a little bit, down around the bottom. Probably clear out some of this underbrush uh, a little bit above the Adam's apple. So that'll definitely thin out the beard. But I haven't decided what shape I want the beard to be yet. So I don't know if I just want something kind of like a rounded beard, kind of like that. I don't know if I want something that's kind of uh, pointed at the end. I haven't decided yet. So if you have a suggestion, go ahead and leave it in the comments below. Moving on to subscriber questions and comments. Uh, Chris, again, thank you for all your comments. Um, I really did enjoy smoking that Five Vegas, Vegas Classic with Rachel. She is a friend of mine from the Grand Junction, or I'm sorry, from uh, the Rem Smoke Shop Lounge here in Grand Junction, Colorado. She kindly agreed to do a cigar review with me, so uh, I just put her on the video. It was it was the first time I've done a review with somebody, and I, th I think it actually turned out really, really well. I, unfortunately, there are no uh, new subscribers to welcome this week, so I need to work a little bit harder, kind of promote my channel a little bit more, and uh, get some new subscribers so I can welcome to the channel. Once I do hit 100 subscribers, I will be doing a giveaway, uh, probably of some beard products, maybe a cigar or something, but uh, we need to get to 100 subscribers first. So if you can actually help me with that, actually that'd be fantastic. Go ahead and talk to people about this channel, about my beard, about uh, the reviews that I do, and go and promote my channel. Word of mouth is always fantastic. So again, once we hit 100 subscribers, we'll be doing a giveaway. We just need to get there first. Also, I just received everything that I need to start my uh, my production of my own beard products. So I will be doing that. I will still be doing, uh, I'll be doing a beard oil, a balm, and a wax for now. Right now there's only one scent, but I plan to do uh, a total of four scents and an unscented in the future. Uh, but for right now, I'm just going to do my one uh, scent. It's the uh, Spanish Bakery. It's very cinnamony. It's It's fantastic. So I'll actually put that out on uh, on my store here probably within the next week. And I'll give you an up update next week about how everything's going. I will also be doing the Bossman Beard product review uh, here very, very shortly. Um, I've been using the products for about three weeks now. I have a, I have everything down. I have my final thoughts. I just can actually film the review and then get it edited and posted. I'm still waiting on my Allen Edmonds to come in. Uh, these, if you remember, uh, these are the shoes that I bought off of eBay. I went ahead and sent them in to get recrafted, which means new soles, uh, new heels, new welting, new laces. Uh, I have. I'll put the link for the for their video and how they did do everything uh, down below. But it's a fantastic service. And my, I want to find out if that's an option so you can take uh, used products, uh, used shoes and get them refurbished and then 
uh, instead of having to pay full price for uh, shoe, for the Allen Edmonds. Uh, Allen Edmonds are very expensive, but they're very, very, very good shoes. So I'm just trying to see what how you get the best money. Uh, how you get I'm sorry, how you get the best value for your money. Well, that's all for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And you can go ahead and follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, uh, all those at The Dapper Man US. And, of course, our website, thedapperman.org, is up and running. So please take a look at that. I hope you have a fantastic day, whatever's left, and I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.